Hello everybody, Kirito Skylar here, and today, well, actually it's the same day, <laughs> like I said guys, I'm doing a bunch of recordings, um, while I can right now, so I was trying my best to actually get our credits up, well, uh, as soon as I started to try doing that, um, fortunately our fleet got over here, but, then this happened, the main fleet that we were warned about, went to Corellia. Yeah. So I have not had any time to upgrade a blast thing. At all. Wow, well, get back some we have some minor things here. Yeah, yay. <laughs> My guess is they're yeah, they're gonna take a hyperspace route over here to to that plant, so we're going to meet up with this little fleet of Imperials. I don't know who it is is who we're going against, but I don't like this. We're gonna lose. This is, this, this battle is lost. There's three Imperial Star Destroyers from YSL. Multiple broadside cruisers. Yeah. That works. But it's only a level 2 space station, so it's not exactly a big loss. We got 7,000 credits a day, so I mean, that's gonna be easy to repair. But, ay 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 ay. The good thing is they are not bringing a ground force, which fortunately also for this planet, um, we have a massive ground force on below, so yeah, that's the good news. So guys, that last battle though, I can't believe how long of a space battle that was, but yet we were still able to successfully do that. Five Imperial Star Destroyers, now we're fighting against three more. <laughs> Now in canon, guys, I mean, the Empire had over 25,000 Star Destroyers. Like, no joke, that's how many they had in the entire Imperial fleet. But, um... Oh, man. Let's just hope that we can do this, uh... About quickly. Come on, load! Do it! Load! 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 I... I demand it! Do it! Load! Okay, it's loading. Okay, so... Pro the uh, pop production boost for Corellian Corvettes. Great. I will have made Corellian Corvettes on this planet, guys. But, um... The reason I didn't was because... I really have no way of doing that right now, unfortunately. Um, Corellian Corvettes just... I don't know. I, I uh, didn't have... Enough space, I guess you say. I mean, I could have built three, but I wanted to build, like, I want to make five of her own thing on each planet, I guess you say, and just continue on. But, well. Forests, jungles, hills, fields, and seas. Basically put, it's like Earth. But with a very long loading time. Humans, Salonians, and draw. Yep, that sounds fun. Okay, come on, load this last thing since I started reading this. Cost of Corvette size ships is reduced due to the presence of the Corellia Engineering Corporation. Yay. Corellia is a temperate planet covered by rolling hills, thick forests, lush fields, and large seas. Although regarded as an industrial world, the majority of the planet's inhabitants occupy small towns or farms. The galaxy's most prolific starship manufacturing company, Corellian Engineering Corporation, maintains orbital shipyards at Corellia, allowing the plant to remain largely rural with a very long loading time. Loading time is me talking about the game. Come on, hurry up. This is getting annoying. Come on. Hey, yeah, yeah. So, guys, a long time ago, right when I was really young, uh, this was. Oh, what was it? Um, oh. Why am I yawning? Sixth grade. This song would be a nightmare on my old computer because it would free my game would freeze at times, and all I would have to do is listen to that. It was terrible. Okay, Our we've already lost. Me that an imperial fleet is closing in on us. We 
must defend the innocent inhabitants of this planet. That lag. Lowdy, lowdy, head to that lag out. Oh, no. Ready for action. Hey, wait a minute. We got that uh, already. Right. Form up. And then they got yikes. See what I mean, guys? We've already lost. There's nothing I can really do about this. We need to try to take out a few ships. We have smaller vessels, at least. But that's all we're gonna do. Space station's already being hit, so I'm getting fast anything into it. Mainly aiming for that. Hey, maybe I can take out one of these target cruisers, though. That might be. That would be good. Yeah, we're about to lose a lot of things here. Yeah, we can take out the target cruisers, I think. That will be a good way for us to start this off. Multiple Imperial Star Destroyers, though. Multiple. And they got a commander or two of this. Yeah, we've been able to take out that, I think. And we might be able to take out that. Holy cow. Attack! At your command. I got it. Ready. The good is gone. Okay. Waiting your orders. Well, it doesn't look like we have any bombers here, so. Fire. I guess we just keep on firing at this. Receiving message. Our space station's been hitting that pretty hard there. At your command. But. Our little Corellian Corvette has also been hitting targets hard. I must say, I'm actually kind of surprised at how this battle's already going. And now we're going to lose. And we will lose. We can still give him a black eye at least. Decoding transmission. I know it could last a little bit longer, but oh well. Like I said. You know you're gonna lose. There's no point in even trying this one. It really isn't. I mean, don't get me wrong, we are doing good. I mean, we're doing absolutely great. But, um... Good job, boys. Keep it up. Just hold off the empire a little bit longer. It's all we gotta do. We don't even have to destroy all their forces. Just get up. Now we get to destroy fighters. Station ready. All right. They don't even have their bombers on the up. Yeah, they got Admiral uh, Piet or Captain Piet. That's great. All fire on the torpedo launcher. Sorry, guys. I said Admiral because um, <laughs> because of what, uh, the Star Wars movies. My bad. <laughs> Uh, man, well, you know Star Wars so well. Wall. Orbital command yeah, available. you can take out. Come on, blast it. We got it. We got it. Locked off. Roger that. Yeah, we're about to lose the, uh... Yeah, they took out the main thing that we need. Well, that's it, guys. We have lost this already. I mean, don't get me wrong. We had a good run. I mean, we took down three of their ships. I mean, that that was more than we could have hoped in general. I mean, yeah, we've lost our star, star fires. No way, no way. Yeah, we're gonna lose the space station. Sorry guys, that's Facebook notifying me about uh, somebody. Um, I said that uh, person I've been talking to is really cool. I've uh, been talking to her all day. And, yeah, I didn't tell her I was recording. Whoops. Um, well, I told her I was working a lot, so she won't understand that. But anyways, um, I don't know why it's not like we ought to resolve this. It's not so. Yeah, it's not like we ought to resolve. But we've already lost the battle, so it doesn't really matter. And they've got us in a track to We're going to try to speed this up, guys. We've been here because the battle is taking too long. And 
So here's the plan. Watch this. This is where it gets good. We're gonna meet them head on. We're gonna just instantly meet them dead on. Yeah, we took out a few. I mean, Aquamar and two during the blah 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 cruisers. <laughs> Could not talk there was. <laughs> oh jeez. Okay. Anyways, we're okay. We're going over Corellia now. Setting course. Oh, we're on. It's on. Construction complete. I'm hoping that they don't move anything down below. We need more that we Building need to increase started. this. Vehicle in production. And we'll build some aerial units. And um. Vehicle canceled. We'll do ground unit really fast. There we go. Perfect. That should be enough, and then we'll meet them head on, and yeah, I think that'll be good. Now let me, give me a second, guys. I gotta check this uh, message really quick, because, uh, yeah, so. Sorry about that, guys. Alright, I'm back. Anyways, um. So, let's see where our fleet is really quick. Okay, our fleet is meeting, is almost to cool out right now. Almost there. As soon as we reach Kuat, we'll be able to uh, go and defend Corellia. I feel like if we had a um, level 5 station, though, at Corellia, we could have instantly stopped them. I mean, honestly, we have a pretty mean defense position here already. And it's not like they're going to go Gunboat down here, to Bothawa, etc. So, yeah. So this is the final battle we're going to be doing today, guys. Uh, this, and, uh, yeah. I try to keep these battles short as I can because of, um, well, because of uh, how uh, long it takes to upload. And um, yeah, last battle was pretty long. I'm gonna. I, I've been trying kind of to, uh, you know, sleep on the upload. I guess you say. Um, Tactical battle. But mm -hmm. yeah, and that is victory, right there. Nine X wings, three A wings, uh, four, five capital ships. <laughs> the tables have turned. All right, so we're gonna come out of hyperspace on these guys, and we're just gonna hold our position. That's all we're gonna do. We may not have that many fighters, but that's okay. We're gonna have to protect our Corellian corvettes, though. They're gonna be our main uh, support line. Come on now. Gotta hate how the loading time is. It's a nightmare. You know, that one day we had where we captured so many planets, guys, is the day that we literally had no lag. Wasn't that a great day? <laughs> Unbelievable. I mean, literally, we captured so many planets in like a few, in an hour or so, and literally. It's like, oh yeah, we can't even get through a single space station or a space battle without 10 years of freaking just waiting. How exciting. But yeah. Anyway, guys. Um, so, I'm thinking about doing um, 
some work on some video games actually or in the near future here I don't know for maybe Star Wars Battlefront 2 and then once I get done with them showing off the uh, uh, maps or whatever I don't know what kind of maps I was gonna mainly do space maps because I, I enjoy uh, starships in space a lot more than I do uh, ground combat but yeah just an idea I may make my own campaign too um, if I can for Star Wars Battlefront 2 that'd be fun actually that would be really fun um, maybe something on the planet Sky or uh, got one of the Outer Rim planets not sure yet but anyways just an idea so anyway guys this should be a quick bow and then we'll uh, be done with uh, today's uh, uh, episode so yeah or well today's continuous uh, like non-stop recording of episodes <laughs> don't know what's going on with Wix guys um, Wix is being a nightmare right now for me to be honest I mean it's been a complete nightmare it's um not letting me do the things I need to for my friends uh, website it's for her YouTube channel you guys can actually check out uh, my uh, little thing on the side uh, in the about section I think it's uh, I think you'll see it where it says um, friends channels um, distracted kitty is one of them and uh, Delena is a uh, girl I'll be hopefully hang out with here really soon and me and her will be doing recordings later on and then that'll be fun because god I'll be in person and well I haven't hung out with anyone in person years um, so not that that's weird or anything just I really well I've been pretty much stranded with no car here so it's like you know without any friends and no car it just you can't really get out that well <laughs> so but anyways yeah but also my friend Katie uh, she does recordings so or not recording she does uh, I am with you videos for um anime Destroying stuff so if you guys are interested in that go check tactic. it out try to separate yeah. the defending units to pick so. them apart totally recommend all our channels guys and yeah and we have a really big fleet here and we have a really there big they fleet. are hi Fire. oh we're just gonna wreck them open fire affirmative beware of traps the force. Yeah, we need to make sure our troops uh, are safe. This is a lot of vessels. Oh my gosh, this is a lot of bombers. Hello. Okay, maybe this was a little bit more than what I thought. Um. No, we are really damaging. Uh, was anyone else expecting us to damage them this bad? Because I sure as heck wasn't. We just let two ships rain through. Open fire! There's one gone. Can't believe us. We were already just dominating. Wow. That Imperial Star Story needs to be taken out immediately. Standing by. They had three though, didn't they? We may actually be able to, uh, make a three. Yep. Yeah, this battle is going a lot quicker than the last one, guys. Gone out there. Come on, guys. The last one. Yep, we just took out a target crew. Take out that hangar bag. That's gonna be an easy target. Ouch. Those really, uh, those are not really. Those one got my cruisers are really hacking pretty hard. I mean, we're completely destroying everything here. Acknowledge. 
Continuously taking out this entire fleet. <laughs> Ships aren't really taking that bad damage either. This is a good day for the rebellion. The Empire continuously keeps losing that pretty much every it, it amazes me how hard they keep on trying to fight us, but it just it's Order, not sir. I am with you. So many starfighters. Good job, boys. Take out the iron cannon and fire out their engines. I want that ship to be turned into space dust. Yep, that will turn into space dust. Bam. May the force be with us. I like to pull us out this nebula. But a battle in the nebula would, is fine. Whatever. Target! Confirm! Reporting. I'd really like to have more ships. We're right here. Right 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 okay, you here. You can shield start shield. shooting this. Order confirmed. Yikes. Oh wow. What oh one's already here? taking him out. Target sighted. And there's the Admiral. Ready weapon. And they're already damaged Imperial Starster that is being trashed. Open fire. We need to take out that tractor beam. I said that tractor beam there is like Ready. the main thing we need to wipe out real quick. Guys. Ha. Yeah, what now? Alright, we're moving out. I'm moving the fleet out of that nebula. That nebula's been a nightmare. Yep, we're moving out of the nebula and we're moving right towards our fleet and we're going to be able to destroy every single Imperial starship that they have here. Oh my, oh my. Oh, and they got one more Imperial Star Destroyer coming ass. Oh no, whatever shall we do? I'm honestly not even threatened by this anymore. I really am. Target! Confirmed! All power to the engine! Target sighted! Blast Ready every single fighter, Corvette. You can do it. Your allies are more focused on everything else. You there! Oh, you mind taking out this? Fire. Just because you can, thank you. Now I want you to attack this. You can attack this. Reporting it. Yeah, it's going well. You see, they're doing the same tactic again, where they just kept on coming in towards us, and we just kept on pushing them back. That tactic never worked before. It's not going to work again. Acknowledge. Fire. Yep, and then we're about to have an turbo laser again. Open fire! Turbo laser system's gone. These ion cans are pretty nasty weapons. In fact, supposedly it's also classified as a super weapon because of how it can take down ships. I mean, if you guys saw how how they handle uh pedestals in Rogue One with uh Wild wings that flew over that one star store, disabling it, and then uh, they used a hammerhead to uh, collide with it, pushing it into the air one to take down the shield on Scarif. That, that's an, that was an insane fight. Come on, guys, take it out. Mm, I don't know how they'd feel about this one. Uh oh, what's happening now? Oh no, am I about to? Oh, 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 this is overkill. 
I, okay, overkill much, come on. Hello. Oh no. Yep, shields are up. Oh jeez, well guys, I overkilled it. I completely overkilled this bow. Oh my gosh. I just brought in... Okay, now there's five capital ships here. I mean, this... Yep. Like I said, overkilled it. And that ship's all the way out here. Oh jeez, I think he just took out... He probably took out, but he didn't. Uh, that ship's over here. Uh, I was hoping we took out that vessel already. Oh well. That's okay, we've already had our victory here. What do you suggest? Concentrate all fire to that target. There's too many capital ships for them to even have a victory here. We have them on the run. Ready. The latest car This target. is pitiful. Ready. And I think we just and Oh, are you expecting another? Okay, that's six of them. Okay, that's six capital ships now. They, we, we've won. The Empire is lost. A pity. That growing Corvette is our best bet at survival right now. I hate to say that, but it really More is. Target those lasers. And that Corvette's actually going to be as well. Firing target. Yes, Commander. Because those bombers and Starfires are going to be a nightmare for us. Open fire. I am with you. Oh my gosh. Affirmative. Yep, here we go. Alright. Our, um... Capital ships are here. They're gonna be able to just clean up all these cruisers with me. The force. Be with us. Beware of traps. Shields will be reinforcements. Weapons ready. Target. Monster on the ion cans, boys. Oh wow. Target sighted. It's ready. a bloodbath. Reinforcements are moving. Go ahead and lure the fight fighters in, boys. Power to the shields. Fire. Yeah, we. Wow. Holy cow! It's like a scene out of uh, Star Wars um, Jedi Academy right now. The two. <laughs> Mon Calamari cruisers are blasting at the end of, at the Imperial uh, Star Destroyer. Oh no! Ready. And wow, we have completely isolated all of our starfighters. That's a bad day for them. That's a really bad day. Yeah, just a clean up. That's a victory. We may have lost a few ships, but we didn't lose any. Yeah, you see, we lost everything small. All weak stuff from the last battle we lost. They lost three Imperial Star Destroyers as a commander, Acclimare class cruiser, three broadsides, two Tardin class, and uh, four victory. Now, it would have been two Acclimare class plus an R2 Tardin cruisers if it weren't for the earlier battle. So. Oh, happy day. Time to get our defenses up back on Corellia. We've done a good job here. Y Wing Squadron reporting. Great! Build up the Y Wings. Get them all kicking. Seriously? It shows them retreating to Coralag? There's no fleet at. There's nothing. There wasn't even a. Oh boy. I can't even talk right now, guys. Sorry. There's nothing even left of that fleet for them to even reach. Beginning construction. I mean, really. 
What the heck are they even retreating? I mean, that's kind of funny to be honest. Beginning I'm increasing Solust be um, because of how, you know, important this planet is. I mean, it builds capital ships, just like Kuat. Those two planets are really important. In fact, I think the only planet that they have, mainly, that can actually uh, create capital ships, guys, is Fondor. Complete. Beginning construction. Hello, Karida. Gunboat here, sir. Building started. Construction complete. More of that stuff we have, the better. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna build a space station over here at Karida, I think. The Empire hasn't attacked it yet, so, yeah. Anyway, guys, I think I'm gonna end the episode here, though. We're gonna keep on building up our bases and facilities, so, yeah. So, hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Kirito Gaming. Uh, like, subscribe, favorite. Don't forget to, uh, comment and, um, tell me what you guys want me to do next. We may actually go after Coralag. Just because we have some unfinished business on Coralag. So, Tactical that's a plan. Imminent. Now Bastine's being randomly under attack. By one ship. That is the funniest thing. Ever. Anyway, guys, um... That's it for this episode. I'm Kirito Skylar. And I will see you guys later. Bye bye. One ship, really? They're going to send one ship towards me. Boy, aren't they bold.